Welcome back to Chinformi News with all the latest news from the world of immigration. The 2010 decree on immigration flows has been published in the official journal. Starting from Wednesday, the 21st of April, it will thus be possible for employers to forward applications for work permits to allow the entry of seasonal workers. The application must be presented online by registering at the site of the Ministry of the Interior or else through representative associations or employment consultants. Up to 80,000 people will be able to come to Italy for the purpose of seasonal work. Other categories include up to 4,000 people for the purpose of self-employment and up to 2,000 people, non-seasonal workers, who have completed education and training programs in their country of origin. The Minister of the Interior has reminded the offices responsible for examining applications for seasonal work permits that it would be possible to give priority to applications requesting permits for workers to be employed starting from this spring. The electronic system for managing applications adopted by the Ministry indeed makes it possible to sort applications on the basis of the start date indicated by the employer. At all events, and on a more general level, the chronological order of arrival of applications will be respected. In the last three years, there has been a considerable increase in applications for Italian citizenship, mostly based on residence rather than on marriage. This is the data emerging from the 2009 statistics on applications and the granting of Italian citizenship. The definitive statistics are available online at the site of the Minister of the Interior at the address www.interno.it. It should be specified that these figures do not include data regarding citizens who decide to take Italian nationality when they reach the age of 18. The statistics also exclude the acquiring of citizenship by adoption. The number of mixed marriages in Italy is increasing according to the report on marriage presented by the National Statistics Institute. The study shows an increase in the number of couples in which at least one of the partners is of foreign nationality. Almost 37,000 marriages in 2008, 15% of the overall figure. According to ESET, this is a significant phenomenon, both in terms of the rapid increase and because it represents one of the most important indicators of the process of integration of immigrant communities in our country. The frequency of marriages involving at least one foreigner is greater in areas where there are more stable and deep-rooted immigrant communities. That's all for today from the world of immigration. Goodbye and thank you for joining us.